Woods had an amazing decade on the course. He, he won 12 of his 14 majors in this decade. He won um, 54 times on the PGA Tour uh, in this decade. He won at a rate of about 30%. So when the members looked at that, when the editors looked at that, they put it all together and they decided that he was the athlete of the decade and his accomplishments even outweighed Lance Armstrong and uh, people like Michael Phelps with his amazing Olympic performance in the pool. He was one of just six athletes who got more than, more than a single vote, and he got 56 votes. The nearest competitor was Lance Armstrong, who only got 33. Roger Federer was next with 25. We invited uh, our editors at newspapers all over the country to vote, and we contacted them by, by email. We sent out uh, um, advisories on the AP Newswire asking them to vote, and then we tabulated the results here. And we had over 140 people actually voted in the, uh, in the poll. The Tiger Woods scandal, if you will, the, uh, all, of the, all of the personal turmoil that Tiger has been through, in the past uh, few weeks really had very little effect on the voting. Voting began a few days before his accident and he had already established a lead and he maintained that lead and it even grew a little bit I think um, in the past couple of weeks. So uh, it really didn't have too much impact. I think that our members, uh, our member editors who voted uh, on the ballot, who voted on the athlete of the decade, were able to distinguish between Wood's personal life and his accomplishments on the course. I think people made a distinction between Tiger Woods the athlete and Tiger Woods the man. Um, wh when you think about what he's accomplished on the golf course, if you looked back a month ago, if this, if this contest had happened a month ago and we hadn't had the traffic accident and everything that followed, there wouldn't be very much question at all whether Tiger was the, the top athlete of the decade. And I think that the editors just decided that that was still the case uh, no matter what had happened in his personal life. People like Michael Phelps also had fantastic performances, but Phelps' moment in the sun was really limited to the, uh, to the Olympics in 2004 and then 2008. Um, Usain Bolt, who also got more than one vote, was kind of the same thing. He set records in the 100 meters and the 200 meters, but that's just been in the latter stages of the decade. Before Woods, there really wasn't a person in this generation who could really go out there and you would think that he may really win this tournament, and then he would on a consistent basis. Um, Woods won 12 majors. He won the, the, what was called the Tiger Slam. He held all of the major titles at the same time and um, he won eight money titles on the PGA Tour in this, in this decade. And so it was week in, week out, year after year.